Kel, overall, just for the trip, with how you guys started just in that first quarter, how did things shift and change? Um, I think we just got too happy on the farm. Um, I think we just stopped playing defense and they got on the run, you know, got confidence and, uh, you know, and came back and, you know, pushed it from there. When it comes to just like things shifting, just the focus wise, is there anything that you've seen that's been kind of similar from this game and Detroit that you guys can kind of hone in on? Um, you said positives or, like or just kind of like the focus. Uh, focus. We just just got play for whole forty eight. You know what I'm saying? We obviously there's gonna be runs, but you know at least let them score off. You know tough shots. You know game we'll miss, but can't have lapses on defense where we mess up. We kind of got to let them score on some tough twos, tough threes, but we can't have slip ups and um, give and transition like wide open layups, dunks, wide open threes. So we just got to be better, just intention, just the whole 48 minutes. This is the second game in a row where kind of guarding your yard was an issue. You know, there were a lot of kind of line drives. Um, in your mind, has there been a commonality that's led to that or? Uh, I think it's just the guy on ball and also just, you know, guys being in a shift and help each other, you know what I'm saying? It's not just you out there. We just got to have four guys out there, you know, even for not everybody's helping, just presenting. Um, but also, you know, saying a guy on ball can't let up sh straight lines, but, you know, we just got to communicate if there's slips and stuff like that. Um, and just make sure we, you know, locked in our coverage. At this point, how frustrating is it that You've been kind of seeing the same things, like lapses on defense, effort. How how frustrating is it at this point in the season that those similar things keep coming up? Yeah, no, it's not it's not fun at all. Um, I mean, it just turns to us losing and losing ain't fun. So we just gotta get it right, you know. We just gotta, you know, with effort and stuff, but just you know, being detailed. I think it's the fifth game for you in a row. You played at least 38 minutes. So I guess for you, just kind of how are you feeling, trying to manage this this heavy load at this point? No, I'm alright. Just. Got to be better, honestly. That's what it is. Just, you know, more minutes or whatever it is. Just, just got to be better, both ends. Would you just like to have Cam Thomas back and to see him go up there in the first eight minutes, have, you know, 17 points? Yeah, great. And he scoring, you know, you know what he does best. And it's because we ease with him. And, you know, he came back and just straight to it like he never left. So it was great to have him out there. And, I mean, shit, you know, we're going to need him. You know, we need everybody. You know, when Cam, other Cam comes back. But, you know, it's happy for him to come out here. You know, have his rhythm, you know, like he had never been out. But, uh, no, definitely need it every time. It's the first game of a back-to-back. -back. Now you got to go to Cleveland. And I know you, you mentioned it just about playing for that full 48 minutes. But for tomorrow night, what is going to be key when you just focus in on this team? Setting the tone early. And, like I said, not be happy on the form if we go up early. We just got to stay with it, you know, you know, stay the course and just win the game.